Great day, it's Amanda, and I just wanted to come to you briefly on a topic, and that topic is backbiters, the Lord rebuke you. Now, first of all, let me give a disclaimer. Um, I come in here in a spirit of love, in a spirit, you know, to not cause any type of shame or condemnation, but in the word it states that open rebuke is better than secret love. So I want to jump on here real quick. I stand on, let the redeemed of the Lord say so, whom he hath redeemed from the hand of the enemy. So first of all, I want to bind up any type of demonic retaliatory demons. He sharabasia, utorosaka, mansharada, utabra bababa, shutako, shatabra, mantabaka. All have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. But this was really pressing upon my spirit. Lately, I've been seeing high levels of witchcraft. Amen. It's been an extreme attack against me. But God says, many are the afflictions of the righteous, but the Lord will deliver them out of them all. Sometimes, my friend, hallelujah, before I get into backbiters, I want to admonish you to fellowship with other believers. It says, don't forsake the assembling of yourselves with other believers. Amen. So again, this is not a message on hate. Hallelujah. Oppression and terror shall be far from thee. You know, the Lord tells us that this is one of the promises that he has for us as believers. You know, he calls us his beloved. He says, beloved, I wish above all things that you be in health and prosper, even as your soul prospers. But I cannot, hallelujah, skirt around this issue of backbiters, okay? Now, I'm not going to get into theology or anything of that nature. But what I will say, it's of Satan. And Satan comes to still kill and destroy, but Jesus came to give us life and to give us life more abundantly. See, the nature of a backbiter will reach in. There's also a scripture that says, deliver my soul, O Lord, from lying lips and from a deceitful tongue. One of the main characteristics of a backbiter is someone who's a talebearer. And then the Bible, it says when the talebearer is gone, the strike disappears along that line. So I'm here to let you know that you can equip yourself against the wiles of the enemy when these demonic principalities try to jump on folks. Okay. See, the thing about this is to remember is to stand on Romans 8, which states, what shall we say to these things to God before us? Who can be against us? A backbiter's main technique, hallelujah, and maneuvering in the demonic is to try to Hallelujah, reach back to a previous time. But as I stated in Romans 3, 23, it states, all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. It says, um, you know, somewhere in the scripture about, you know, you're talking about the moat in your eye, the moat in your brother's eye, get the moat out of your eye. Amen. He shut up our seat to what it calls for is self-examination. And a lot of times if we're not careful, even as believers, you know, this self-righteous spirit can come upon you. Hallelujah. But that's why it's important to do as it says in James 4.10, humble yourself in the sight of the Lord and he'll lift you up. Let me tell you something, my friend. In Romans 8, it states, who shall lay anything to the charge of God's elect? It is God that justifieth. He shut up Rabba We bind up demonic eavesdropping demons. He shut up. The Lord rebuke you. Break now by the power of the living God. Mantabropa. Shut up. Bacatarosa. Torosa. Tamantabra. Hallelujah. Lord. He shut up. I to dispatch your ministering angels. Even now from the north, south, east and the west that you have given charge over us to keep us in all of our ways. We go from faith to faith and we go from glory to glory. But I thought it important. Hallelujah. Jump on here and give a word of rebuke to the backbiters. Hallelujah. He shut up. There's no power in that. Masharabasi Tarosia, going behind people's back. Hallelujah. It says in the word to let all things be done in decency and order. I'm not a theologian. I'm not a part of the clergy. I'm a believer giving my testimony. And in the word, I found out for myself where it says, be angry and sin not. Hallelujah. Don't let the sun go down on your wrath, neither give place to the devil. And a lot of times, if we're not careful, hallelujah, the number one space Praise God that the enemy will try to occupy is that position of backbiting, craftiness. Know those who labor among you. Understand this. How can two walk together unless they be in agreement? And that's found in Amos. I'm here to let you know, my friend, that you don't have to be the victim of backbiters. Hallelujah. They smile in your face and all the time they want to take your place. That's called a backbiter. Who shot about Kaktab? And then the Bible says where striping envying is, there's every evil work. I'm here to encourage you, my friend, on today that whatsoever good any man do if the same shall ever see of the Lord. Lay not yourself up charges on the earth. Hallelujah. Where folks can break in and steal. Literally. Hallelujah. Where witch doctors. Hallelujah. Will try to use points of contact. Hallelujah. To try to get a trace of bloodline on you. On your family. We break that witchcraft in the name of Jesus. The angelic host were present. He But we don't bring rebuke without bringing restoration. 
I'm here to let you know that if you confess your sins unto the Lord, hallelujah, forgive, hallelujah, he's going to heal the land. He shut up a seat. I'm not here to offer you any type of counsel, but I'm here to let you know the devil can't just take your shirt, your bracelet, your ring, hallelujah, your blood, hallelujah, sanitary uh, personal possessions and dip it in blood. That's not enough. That's witchcraft. Hallelujah. We're talking about backbiters. Hallelujah. Trying to size you up with points of contact. You're trying to get a figure devil blacklisted. Hallelujah. The Lord rebuke you. He shut up about Manta. Hacking into people's messages. Blacklisted. Hallelujah. Backbiting. Hallelujah. Reaching to the past. No man having put their hands to the plow and looking back as fit to the king for the kingdom. You say, get thee behind me, Satan, in the name of Jesus. We bind up that spirit of terror and backbiting. And we ask that the Lord bring divine, supernatural realignment. Well, until next time, my friend, understand that the Lord executes righteousness and judgment for all that are oppressed. He won't do wickedly, and he won't pervert judgment. As long as the earth remains, there'll be seed, time, and harvest. Don't think more highly of yourself than you ought. Love and shalom.